Hey guys, welcome back to the channel. Hope you guys are doing well. This is episode number 95 of our Mason Mount series. Our Mason Mount series is coming to an end. In another 5 episodes, we'll end this whole Mason Mount series and we'll be starting a new one with a different player. And I'm pretty sure you guys are going to enjoy the new series as well. So in today's uh, episode, we are going to be looking at our weekly signings. This is part 15 of our weekly signings in this channel this is a now this is a pure opinionated video you guys uh, you don't have to take a particular player just because i took it and i have my reasons to take a player you guys will have your reasons to take a player so leave a comment telling why you guys chose player a or player b now without any further ado let's get into the club first let us look at the formation and the lineup we are using right now for the mystery signing squad that we have been building so far from day one so as you guys can see in front of you, this is how the mystery signing squad looks as of now. We have a uh, 90 rated Rooney that we got in the previous episode. We have Cordobra, uh, 90 rated that we got in the previous episode. And we have De Jong. These three are the only 90 rated players you have had so far uh, in the weekly signings. And we have them in the squad right now. And so if you guys look at the right wing position, we are using right mid Diaby who was 87 I think. So he has been brought down to 84 because he's playing off position, out of position. So yeah, hopefully we'll get a right winger in this episode. Now I have opened the first one. I forgot which one it is. What does it say? Does it say right? It does it actually say right winger? Wow. So I think we'll be getting a right winger in this episode. Now let us go through this quickly and then reveal both the players and then see whom we might be getting. Who was the first player? I didn't look at it. I said Williams. Iñaki Williams Okay, not bad. Is that a captain's card? Iñaki Williams This is a captain's card 97 pace on him With 82 shooting and 81 dribbling That is Okay, we get both uh, right wingers So no matter whom we choose It's gonna be a right winger One is Premier League and the other one is La Liga And uh, you know what? This is a good choice, you know, and I'm happy that both are right wingers. So we will definitely be getting uh, our position that we are looking for. Now, Inyaki Williams has better stats, but his overall is less. But Bumo has lower stats. I mean, his shooting and dribbling is really good. Only pace is low. Inyaki Williams' pace is good and shooting and dribbling are bad. So what do we go for? Do we go for better pace or better dribbling? This is one confusion that I have. Let me know in the comment section guys right now whom you chose. Whom you chose? Both are right wingers. One is a higher overall and one is a high rated player. So which one did you go for? I am actually curious you know. I am actually curious. Now in this episode we will get one of these players and then we will go put them in this club and see how the club looks. I am not going to be playing any games because it's just i will get smashed guys we are, the people who are playing uh, versus and head to head have 10 times better team than what i'll be using so yeah okay now we need to go have a look at the squad drb definitely has better players i'm not gonna try okay drb has better pace and better dribbling now if we go for inyaki williams he'll be an 89 rated player but he'll have good pace but we go for the other player Brian, will he will have good pace. I mean, he'll have good dribbling and good shooting, but he'll have only 90 pace. I mean, 90 is not bad, you know. If I have to level him up, he might reach like 95 or 96, which is still better. Now, this is the what is it called? National Valor card, and this is the Captain's card. So, let me know which card you guys chose. And he is only 24 years old. He has. Uh, two star weak foot oh my god that's woeful and he he also has two star weak foot what and um, four star skill move for brian as well so i think i'm gonna go for brian guys i'm gonna go for the highest rated overall i will be losing a lot of pace i'll be using around seven pace so it is fine i think i mean i'm not gonna be using the squad i'm just gonna build a squad with weekly signings every week with you guys uh, and we'll see at the end of um, this whole game or this whole season how we are doing and yeah so this is our fourth 90 rated player i think he's going for a bit of change you know actually but i don't think he is tradable is he i'm pretty sure he's not tradable 
If he is tradable, I'll sell him right now. He is not tradable. Makes sense. It did say. It did say it's not tradable. I forgot about that. Okay, now let us go. Now we'll bring him here. Where is he? Oh my God! Look at this. Look at the number of players here. Where do I search? Okay, he's here. <laughs> so we do get a good bit of stats. If you guys see the Abi and him also. He has minus six pace, so he has only ninety, and the other has ninety six, and Inya has ninety seven. So we are losing a lot of pace, but I think this team is looking decent. We have three, four ninety rated players, four ninety rated players, and two, three eighty nine, no four eighty nine rated players, and we need to get a center mid as well. Uh, Pele is at, I mean Pele stats are really good, so I don't mind even if he's low rated because he's playing out of position. uh it doesn't matter actually you know what this this team looks decent for a weekly signing squad i think this team looks decent if i had to go up against other weekly signing squads i think it will be similar uh, so yeah hope you guys enjoyed this video i'll see you guys in the next video i am posting uh, fifa mobile videos a little less because fifa 24 content there is a lot of FIFA 24 content coming your way every single day. I am posting, so make sure you guys check out the channel. Hit the subscribe button helps out a lot. We are so close to 350 subscribers. It will be awesome, guys. So yeah, I'll see you guys in the next one. Until then, take care, stay safe, stay motivated, and keep smiling. Bye bye.